The consumer price inflation number got a little hotter in September. That means you're paying more for staples, eggs, milk, bacon. And that's not all. Madison Allworth is at a Stu Leonard supermarket in New Jersey. How much have prices gone up there, Madison? Yeah, prices are just climbing, Stu, here and really everywhere across the country. Like you said, that index is up 5.4%. So your grocery cart, if it was looking more expensive over the last couple months, that's just continuing. And there's a couple items in general that are going to cost you more than others. So some of the worst offenders, meat is up over 12%. You're looking at bacon, over 19%, and fish and seafood that's over 10%. Those are some of the big items, and you're seeing this across the cart, but I'm here with Stu, the owner of Stu Leonard's. I'm really good. So, like we said, new numbers out today, worse than was anticipated. What are your consumers seeing when they're checking out? How are prices here at Stu Leonard's? Well, you mentioned a couple of the biggies. It's more those luxury items that people want, like, like meat, seafood lobsters through the roof, king crab legs are through the roof. So you're seeing some spikes like that. Overall, there's some pretty good prices in grocery stores right now. So you may have to trim back a little bit, not have that big ribeye steak that you always wanted, but uh, you can get some good prices out there today. And we, we have seen prices trickle up right now. And what are some of the factors that you see, you know, you see the front end, the back end, what is contributing to this increase? Well, one thing with Stu Leonard's, we buy direct from the farms. I'm talking to farmers, ranchers, they all say the same thing. They can't get the labor. They've had to raise labor rates up and transportation has been really tough right now. That's our biggest concern for the holidays right now. That's why I recommend all customers shop early. Your turkey can wait a week in the refrigerator. You know, don't, don't buy it last minute. So try to get everything you can right now ahead of time and stock up. Yeah, okay. So even though prices are maybe a little higher right now, like you said, that supply issue is something we're seeing so much. So we're seeing that price go up. But um, hopefully we've hit a ceiling, although things are not looking incredible. Stu, back to, back to you. Is it not? All right, Madison, thanks very much indeed.